Should the Great Lakes look like this? You can help stop the carp invasion. This shipping canal has connected the Mississippi River to the Great Lakes for a hundred years. But now, seven Great Lakes states want it shut down because of a fish. They breed like mosquitoes and they eat like hogs. They take over any water bodies that, that they inhabit. Some scientists have said that they're going to turn the Great Lakes into giant carp ponds. Like so many invasive species, the Asian carp was brought to the U.S. to do good, in this case to clean commercial catfish ponds, but ended up doing bad when a flood allowed them to escape into the Mississippi River Basin. They've taken over the river. In places in the Illinois River, the Asian carp and the silver carp make up 95%, up to 95% of the fish biomass. Now these things grow to be up to 100 pounds, over four feet long. These are huge, huge fish. It's a true invasion, which we must stop now. Hi, I'm Dr. Doug Inkley, Senior Scientist for the National Wildlife Federation. You can help fight this threat. Please donate now. If Asian carp did get in, they would colonize tributaries and nearshore habitats in the Great Lakes. With nothing to stop them, carp would infect Canadian rivers all the way to the Arctic Circle. Voracious feeders eating up to 40% of their body weight in one day, Asian carp are choking off the food supply for native species. The fear is the shipping canal will be their gateway to the Great Lakes. Once these monster carp get in the Great Lakes, there will be ecological and economic devastation that follows, and we have to prevent that. Catching carp in rivers will reduce their numbers, but there's a growing consensus about the need to disconnect the Mississippi River from the Great Lakes permanently. Let's keep the Great Lakes free of the devastating impact of the Asian carp. Time is running out, and we can't wait another day, so please donate now.